innovation for us is, is the lifeblood of the company. And uh, we have invested certainly over the last uh, uh, three, three years, we have stepped up in, into innovations and it takes very different and various forms. It is not only about the process we use to brew and ferment our products, how we go with our environment, consumption of water and energy, all these processes are constantly improved as that the footprint they leave on our planet being reduced and improved. That's one aspect of how we innovate. But we also innovate on the consumer end with new products. So we introduce cider to people who didn't know cider. We introduced Belgian brands to Brazilians. We introduced uh, Mexican brands to the rest of the world. And then there is a third leg, which is more fundamental. It's to look at, are there new products, new things that don't exist today, and new ways of, of tapping beer or, or selling beer that don't exist today and that we can introduce so as to make our business a better business. So innovation has many, many faces. And you have to mobilize your organization around the innovations, not only by target setting, but also creating a culture where innovation is encouraged across the board.